In this video, we're looking at the rear camera of the vehicle and we're seeing uh, cars coming up here to merge onto the highway. And I want to turn your attention to the vehicle just behind me. You can see that they are anticipating that these vehicles here on their right are going to have to zipper merge into uh, the highway here. So they're leaving plenty of space between our vehicle and theirs to allow for a merge to happen here. Um, granted, we are in congestion here. I think the light had just turned green and so traffic is kind of moving slow, but it's starting to pick up. But notice this vehicle isn't picking up their speed too, too fast. They're allowing for a differential in speed to take place where the vehicle in the zipper merge, or sorry, in the merge lane can zipper merge into uh, the travel lane, if you will. So um, we can see that that worked out nicely. What too often happens on the road is you'll see that um, in congestion, people follow really close bumper to bumper, and that makes it extra difficult for the vehicles coming up to merge. So notice here, it is an alternating pattern here. So this vehicle found a safe gap behind this vehicle to merge. And so this vehicle will be merging here in between us. Um, now, this goes to uh, point out another uh, topic, which is looking around you, right? So keeping things in your peripheral vision. Is there someone signaling that they're um, wanting to come into your lane? Uh, oftentimes, students are looking just straight at ahead and so they're not seeing the signal of the vehicle next to them so it's something to pay attention to is that it's not just always about where we want to go but also where other road users want to go as well and if they are trying to um, come in in front of us if it's safe to do so we need to accommodate their lane change